wild animals out there? Yeah, it's Africa. <laughs> I know, well, I don't know. I mean, I'm just asking. I've never yeah. been to Africa. Like, you know, honestly, mm-hmm. when you when when movies show different countries and and places and stuff, sometimes mm-hmm. they only show certain places that are, you know, like the most popular places, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so they do. So you just wonder yeah, mm-hmm. like is all of Africa there's just some lion walking down the street or some shit like that? <laughs> you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like is it like yeah. the jungle everywhere or like are we in the heart of the Congo or some shit? Like you know what I'm saying? Like I'm- mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh you could say like you know, there's there are some wild animals, you know, like snakes uh, on the Yo, you know? this guy Anacondas. Yeah, I'm not seeing Anacondas? What yeah, like <laughs> Yeah. Are you kidding? My, yeah, yeah, my, my dad did actually kill some, you know. Some, uh, Yo, some wait snakes. a minute. Wait a minute. Your For dad real. wrestled with an anaconda? No, he didn't wrestle with it. He just, like, had this huge sword, you know. It was like a sword. And then I was, I was really little, so he just, like, killed it, you know. Wow. Yeah. Got, Mason, you need to follow this guy because he could probably <laughs> give you some... <laughs> You know, because when you live in a country where you're around wild animals, you know things that the average person in Britain is not going to know. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So he could give you some tips, Mason, because Mason is like, he wants to work at a zoo and he wants to do all this. Uh, you want to know something? <laughs> there are no coincidences. Green light just did not pop in here for no reason. I'm telling you. you I can't found this shit up. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Wow. David. Mm-hmm. Yes. David. David's my <laughs> admin. Everybody follow David if you're not following so, him already. So He's David. my admin. What's up? So uh, David, green light, he's African. So he's from Somalia uh, and Kenya. His background, he's mixed. And he was given a scoop because you know Mason, he he's wants to do the wild animal thing and everything. And um so I, I was saying, you know, like, do you be seeing lions and shit? And he, his father slaughtered an anaconda, yo. Like, hello. Yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. We need some more stories, Greenlight. When, how, wait, when did you come to America? How old were you when you came to America? Uh, I think I was uh, six. Six, no, eight. Because I was in the third grade. I was like eight years old. So, Oh, you were very young. Yeah. Uh, I came here like somewhere like 2005 to America. So I want to say six. Yeah. So the thing is, is you didn't really live for a long time. And like, because my whole thing is like, (laughs) what did you pick up living in Africa? Like safety stuff with the animals? Because this fascinates me. Uh... I mean, not much, you know. I mean, the animals weren't, like, wild. I mean, there there are animals around, like, spiders. You know, when you're sleeping at night, there's, you know, a bunch of spiders and stuff. Try to call on you and stuff. You have to kill them, I guess, you know. Yeah, but I got spiders. <laughs> yeah. And, well, uh, you're talking about, like, tarantulas or what? Yeah. Yeah, those... Really? I mean, yeah. Like the big I mean, ass killer spiders. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I was really young, you know. I didn't know how what to call it, you know. I didn't know the name for it, so yeah. Wow. There's some animals, you know, in the jungles and stuff, lions and stuff, zebras. Well, yeah. let me ask you a question because I saw this movie called Out of Africa, and. Mm-hmm. Meryl Streep, she was chilling with the other dude. What's his face? Uh, can't think. Robert Redford. That was her man. And they were like in the wild there, whatever. And she got confronted by a lion. And she took like a whip and started whipping his ass. I don't think that's how it's going to go. Because <laughs> that lion going to jump and eat you. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, but wait a minute. Okay, Mason. Thanks for stopping by. Get some yeah, rest and, I'll see you, and make Mason. sure you drink a lot of water because that dehydrates you, all that drinking. Yeah, but 
everybody follow Mason. He's like, yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, because the thing is, is that movie is based on a true story. Hmm. Yeah, and she caught never... off the lion with a whip. <laughs> I never saw anything like that. You take a yeah. whip and you start whipping the lion. <laughs> I mean, look, you got to understand back in the day, I mean, when was when, when did that movie take place, David? Do you know out of Africa? Was that supposed to be in the 1920s? They didn't have like all these guns and, you know, yeah. armory like they do today. They probably mm. just had whips. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Maybe. I was just curious about that. But you're saying the lion would most likely eat you if you try to whip him. I mean, you you coming close to a lion, it's it's gonna eat you, eat you. You know, it's a wild animal. It's a wild I mean, animal. It of course, it's gonna. Eat It'll you. be on my wall. It's gonna jump like, you know. It's yo, it's gonna eat us, but it's not gonna eat David. You know why? David has a bulletproof vest. <laughs> <laughs> and the guns to go with it. Uh. Yeah. Oh God! If you don't know what I'm talking about, you need to follow me on Instagram. Look up mm. the video with David in it where we're talking about his bullet profile. That I'm giving him shit. <laughs> All right. So David, Miss Chloe, she didn't write back 